Hi guys, Mr. Off Waffles here. I am joined today with Glitching Queen. Say hello. Hello, everyone. Howdy. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> we're going to be talking today about the mystery of the missing hat, the supposed missing hat, on Revelations. Because uh, the community has been tearing its hair out about this thing for ages now. The final mannequin on the map, the unoccupied mannequin on the map, we haven't been able to figure it out, but we have had this uh, strange extra hat step floating around, this uh, killing keepers with the turret thing that no one has understood until today, until now, I think, as far as I'm aware at least, yes. right? So what essentially happened was we were talking about a couple of unsolved Easter eggs. So uh, what were some of the Easter eggs we were talking about? There was the chicken was one, right? Yeah, Al's hat was a big topic. Yeah, yeah, that mystery and, hat. Goodness gracious. And you you had said something about how you cannot get the keeper's hat without doing the wolf hat. And I had no clue about that. I was like, really? Mm. I was like, yeah, there's something glitchy going on. And that's where we started to investigate. Right. So we weren't really sure why that was the case. We thought that it was a bit weird that that was the only hat that was dependent on another hat. So uh, we went in game and just jumped on... PC to try and verify that that was still the case in case they'd like patched it or anything. Still the case. So you definitely needed to get the wolf hat in order to get the keeper hat to show, as far as we were aware. But mm -hmm. we then tried switching things up a little bit. So Queen was in game and mm -hmm. gave a shot at the keeper protector like kills that you need to get the chime to play, right? Yeah, it was like 10 or 15 kills with a keeper protector, which I always thought that produced the keeper hat, and it, it didn't, mm. and it right. doesn't. <laughs> yeah, so I think you then jumped in another game, didn't you? And yeah. you're like, okay, let's try and go for the keeper chime from the turret. So that's the 15 keeper kills that we were all going for, and see if that gives us like a progress noise or a completion noise or whatever, just like that isolated thing. Did some testing there, and then... I think the sort of master stroke was to say, okay, let's leave the wolf alone completely. Let's just do the keeper protector and then let's go for the turret kills and see if that does anything special. And I mean, as you can see from Queen's gameplay that's going to be playing in the background here, it brings the keeper hat into existence without the wolf. Yeah, and it gives the completion noise too. And I originally, when I got on the turret, I thought, well, okay, we're, we're going to get the Keeper Protector and get those kills that are needed, and then I'm going to go jump on the turret and get 15 Keeper kills. It didn't even take that many. It took no. seven, and you get the completion noise. Yeah. And then the hat. There's the hat. <laughs> yeah. So, so what this essentially means, as far as we're aware, at least, is that all that discussion that we were having about the mystery extra hat can kind of go out the window for now because uh, mm -hmm. there isn't a mystery hat model in the game files like all the people that have been making custom maps of stuff have looked in the files for more models there aren't any extra hat models so uh, there isn't an extra hat there there's also seemingly no steps towards that mannequin's hat head hat head <laughs> head hat hat <laughs> essentially being found like there's no evidence towards it so it kind of puts the nail in the coffin for the mystery extra hat and at the same time gives us the true correct steps for the keeper hat without the wolf so in summary what what were the the the, the sort of breakdown of the the different sounds that we can get to play yeah that's right so you get the wolf hat and then you get the keeper hat with just getting the keeper protector kills and you're gonna get the completion noise that's gonna give you the keeper hat but then in, in addition to that, because you glitched out a step and skipped a step, you can go and actually do that step. And that step is to get 15, well, for some reason it's 15 keeper kills. And you'll get a partial progress completion noise. You're not going to get that ding along with it, but it's glitched out and it, it plays anyways. When you do the steps correctly, that is eliminated and you can no longer go and get the 15 keeper partial completion noise. So it rules it, you know. It shows that it was a part of that. Right, yeah. So, hate to be the bearers of bad news, <laughs> but yeah. that's that's the way it's kind of turned out. I mean, do you reckon that there might still be a hat somewhere floating about in, in the ether for us, to, for us to find, or what do you think? 
I don't think there's any evidence of it right now. I think that maybe they had ideas about maybe doing something for the Panzer because we've seen that in the past. But because the like King helmet or the Crusader helmet is protective against like the Panzer and his effects, mm. I think it kind of rules out any other helmet that could, you know that could help you. It's a wonderful idea about a Shadow Man hat or. You know, uh, we joked about a uh, little Arnie hat. <laughs> yeah, it's not, looking <laughs> it's not looking good. Not looking good. Yeah. Oh man, I just want to. I want a chicken hat. To be honest, that's what I want. <laughs> chicken hat. Yeah. That would be fantastic. Yeah. Like, bring it on, Trey. Like a big rooster, rooster hat would be perfect. <laughs> so, I think what we'll do now is we'll jump into separate audio streams and show you guys mm -hmm. the differences between the sounds when you're getting the progress and then you're getting the actual completion chime and just show you that with the wolf you get your progress you don't get your completion and then if you do it the full keep away without the wolf you get your progress and your completion and then it's done finished you've got the hat successfully yeah. the true way and it seems like one thing i'll tag on the end here it does seem like treyarch are gonna leave this like this like it might have been a bug at first i think they've made it into a feature because at this point Everyone knows that this is the way it works. So I don't think they'll change it anytime soon. Hopefully. <laughs> that would suck if they were like, well, now that they've realized we're going to just screw them over and switch it around again. <laughs> but yeah, let's uh, let's jump yeah. into the gameplay and take a look at it. And now I'm just going to briefly explain what we were just talking about. And a huge shout out to Mr. Raffle Waffles. We worked pretty hard on this. And I just want to say thank you to him for, you know, working on this with me. So basically there is a glitched out step to the keeper hat. And that's the partial completion noise that we've been hearing by killing 15 keepers with the turrets. We've been able to avoid that step and skip it and go completely around it by building the wolf hat. And I don't know why it did that, but yeah, it left one of the steps just out there in the open, never completed, so it was glitching out. The correct steps for getting the Keeper Helmet is to get 15 Keeper Protector kills, so you just go buy that thing for 5,000 and let it kill like 10 to 15 zombies, and you're going to hear a partial completion noise. Then the next and final step is to kill 7 Keepers with any of the 4 turrets. Once you do that, you're going to hear that completion noise. It's going to have like a ding in it. You can come to the stage here and you're going to see that the hat has shown up. Getting the keeper hat with the correct steps eliminates this 15 keeper kill, like partial completion noise from the turret. So that pretty much proves that it was a part of this all along and just a glitch. The glitched out way of getting the keeper hat was build the wolf hat get 10 to 15 kills with the keeper protector and you would get the keeper hat and because you've completely skipped this killing keepers with the turret part you can go now to the turret kill 15 of the keepers and get a partial completion noise and yeah that's the glitched out step that never got completed so unfortunately yeah it doesn't do anything and it's just part of the keeper hat but now we know how to correctly do it the glitched out way is still a lot shorter and this pretty much concludes that there is not any additional hat, at least not with this keeper turret killing step. But I hope this was clear enough that you guys understand. If you have any questions, just let me know. I hope it helped you out and we'll see you next video.